Good morning, Talawanda. Today is Thursday, May 10th, 2018. Club news for today, there will be no chess club tomorrow. If you purchased a maroon setting stone zip hoodie and left it at Friday's Coffee House, stop by Mr. Arnie's room. He might have it. Setting Stone Literary Arts Magazine has released its first print issue in three years. These will be on sale all week for only $5. The special design custom printed full color magazine feature work from THS students. Pick up a copy today. The following people have work published in the print edition of Setting Stone and have not yet picked up their copy. Molly Monson, Shelby Ben, Justin Beckner, Madison Hubbard, uh, Sarah Lee, Piper Mulhauser, Kayla Jarvis, and Honor Fegan. Get it in room 320. And now for Throwback Thursday, Senior Stereotypes with Isaac Diskin and Company. Senioritis. Noun. A supposed affliction of students in their final year of high school or college, characterized by a decline in motivation or performance. Senioritis shows itself in many ways. Here are seven of the most common symptoms to see if you or a loved one may be suffering from this terrible condition. If you have not ordered, yet ordered a, your copy of the yearbook, visit jostens.com and order today. Orders will be delivered the first week of school in the fall, so make sure to pick up yours by during, up during orientation before school starts or during lunch when you, you get back. If you are a senior and would like to purchase a senior yearbook ad, please see Mr. Zimmerman. He has a space left, but it is going fast. You can even split the cost with your friends and put all of your friends on one page. Go see Mr. Zimmerman sometime this week. And now for world news in Paiji with sports. Scientists warned that Hawaii's Kilauea volcano could erupt ballistic rocks. Grant Hill and Christian Leitner queued up. <laughs> ben Simmons, the baseball pass. And Smart's got it! And the ball game is over! And Boston is headed to the Eastern Conference Finals! Well, there was no hockey last night, so I temporarily switched to basketball. In the only NBA game last night, the Celtics knocked off the Sixers at home by two points to clinch that series. So it's now Celtics-Cavs in the Eastern Conference Final. There's also a big Game 7 in the NHL this evening as Winnipeg and Nashville face off for a trip to the Western Conference Final at 8. The softball team season ended yesterday with a second round playoff loss at Mason. They finished with a record of 7-18 and overall and 3-9 and in the SWAC. They were a young team, so there's more experience now and a better future ahead. Any athletes who are interested in running cross country next school year, please see Mrs. Arnie in room 122 or the athletic office for an information packet and a schedule. That's a broadcast here on this Thursday. I'm Patrick Geshen in full survival mode. <laughs>